What's up everybody? This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. So I've been showing you guys a few videos, a series of videos of me doing green screen effects. I've also showed you guys some editing stuff that I've done using green screen effects. Uh, I've also showed you guys how I did my evil twin video. That was, I did that video without a green screen. But in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how you could add multiple use in one video, it's relatively simple. Uh, so as you can see, I'm by myself, but if I snap my finger, I can edit myself to have two. Or, hey, how about three? Hey, how about four? As you can see, it's a little crowded, right? So in this video, I'm gonna show you uh, how to edit multiple U's, uh, multiple people in one scenario using the green screen effect. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. So as you can see, there's no editing right now. I have, I'm outside. I have a portable green screen right here. And it's a portable green screen that I travel with if I need to uh, do some effects on the go. Uh, and to do green screening, obviously you have to invest a little bit in green screen technology, also with editing software. Uh, and uh, But I wanna show you guys that it's possible with editing software and little green screen effects that you can make your videos pop. Uh, as you watch my YouTube channel, you see a lot of different backgrounds, a lot of different scenarios and stuff like that. But a lot of people ask the question of how I do this, right? And it's relatively simple. Uh, I, in this video, I'm gonna use Camtasia uh, on how I have multiple me's uh, in the beginning of the video. It's relatively simple. Now, I usually do a lot of this green screen stuff in my studio. Again, I show my studio in a, in a lot of my videos and I, my whole studio is covered with green screen from the walls down to the floor. And the reason for that is because sometimes if I shoot some of the floor, I, I need to have that green screen effect also. So uh, one of the things that I had to do before I go into the editing process, I had to do multiple shoots of me. So in this video uh, that I'm going to show you when I do the editing, I ha actually have to do a shoot of me just kind of looking around as a secondary person. And then I had to shoot uh, me again as a third person. And I had to shoot me again as a fourth person. So what, I, what I'm gonna do in this video is gonna show you how I edit all four people in the shot. Relatively simple, especially with green screen effects. All right guys, so here it is. I loaded all my uh, video clips uh, on Camtasia. And the phone that I use is the LG G7. All right, so I, I, I film a lot of my videos on the LG G7 or the LG V40. So this is one of the clips that I use here. I want y'all guys to see this. And as you can see, I'm behind the green screen. As you can see, uh, all the background here. So the first thing I got to do is I got to clear out the uh, background. So uh, if you go down here to visual effects, you see something that's called remove color. Boy, this is so simple. And um, Camtasia pretty much does the work for you. You have to uh, pick the hourglass here uh, and go, I always go about right here and boom, right? So right now, um, I'm kind of, the background is black and you kind of see me here in the background. And what I need to do is edit out the, the background here a little bit. So what I do is I push up here and I grab it and boom, there it is, right? So, real simple. All I'm doing is dragging and dropping, just dragging it, boom. All right, so I still have a little problem here. Still got some green outlines here. So what I do is I usually go to tolerance and I kind of go up and down with tolerance to try to get rid of some of the green effects. Uh, so I always start off about 20 and uh, as you can see 20 kind of got rid of some of the green screen if i go to about 25 as you can see almost all the green screen is gone all right so the green screen is gone and you can make your adjustment with soft you can make it soft you can kind of make it a little softer if you go a little longer there 
boom. The object of the game here is to get rid of all the green that you can, then I can start changing my skin tone a little bit with the hue and stuff like that. So uh, I'm looking good right there. And again, you have to make your adjustments accordingly. So as you can see right here, totally black background. All right, so uh, I wanna add a background. So I'm going to, I got a lot of green screen effects already downloaded actually. Uh, and so here, she use a, my background here. And uh, you know, you can do download anything you want on the internet. Just make sure you're careful as far as, you know, copyright and stuff like that. All right, so as you can see, I got a background. Real simple, man, I did that real simple, right? But I do want to add the other me's in the building, right? So uh, I'm gonna take me right here and I can just grab me and just move it to the side right here. But you know what? I want to kind of make me a little bigger. So I just kind of stretch it out a little bit. Just make me a little bigger there. Just right there, right? Just make me a little bigger. But you know, the background is, is a little off too. So what I want to do is kind of take the background, make it down a little bit, and then I'm gonna make the background bigger. Kind of tone it out a little bit. Kind of make it look realistic. Boom. All right, so now you see me here. Right, and kind of make myself a little bigger here. Let's go a little bigger here. Boom. Okay, so at this point, I'm good here. Right, so let me go on and and uh, start the video so y'all guys can hear this. What's up, everybody? This that is, is. Easy Computer Solutions. So I've been showing you guys a few videos, a series of videos of me doing green screen effects. I've also showed you guys some editing stuff that I've done. All right, so. I didn't change the background, I did the green screen effects, and I got that done. So right now, what I need to do is, I need to add me in the, the mix. So let's go to add me in the mix here, right? I did three takes of myself, just kinda looking around and stuff like that. So that's very important. All right, so there you go right there. So I got three takes of me right here. So that's one, two, actually four takes. So I have four takes of me. Boom. One, two, uh, three, and four. So now I got four of me and right there. Now I got four of me just kind of looking at myself a little bit, but I need to edit this part out. So again, let's go into effects, remove green screen and go to color, take it and pop. Bam, right? So the green screen effects is off and I'm using, I always use the same attributes that I use as far as tolerance and stuff like that, that I already use that's working for me. So 25, 18, 15. So all I do is just 25, 18, 15 right here because that worked out very well for me. And let's go ahead on and get rid of the background. Boom, right? Boom. Real simple. All right. So now since the background is gone, now I can get to edit this part here with the background. All right. So let's go to put that in there. About three. All right. So let's go back to the editing it's part. Relatively simple. Uh, so as you can see, I'm by myself. But if I snap my finger, I can edit myself. Right there. So when I snap my finger, all right, I need to get me in there. Here we go. So now I'm in a picture. <laughs> and I want to use the same attributes that I use for my other one. So I was 60, look at the scale. All right, so put that about 63. All right, and I want to go down a little bit. Boom. All right, so I do look a little bigger here. Right, so let's go on to fix that. Let's go a little bigger right there so I could be the same size, same hike as I am, all right? And you know what? I, I might have to move myself over a little bit because I want to put four of me's in here if I can, right? So let's move me over just a little more and I will put four of me's in. It don't matter, see I'm touching myself, don't matter. All right, so here we go. So let's play back 
And here we go. If I snap my finger, I can edit myself to have two. Or, hey. So I snap my fingers, three. So that's three of me. Right? All right, there it goes. Well, I could just jumble them up if I wanted to. <laughs> All right, let's go with that. Let's see here. All right. Four. All right. <laughs> so I'm going to go with four here. And you know what I could do here? I could just move him to the side right there and I could put him right there and there go number four so I can make my adjustment accordingly now I have four me's all right so let's let's go down and take a look at it and go from there boom my finger I can edit myself to have two there you go or, two hey how about three hey how about four as you can see it's a little crowded right so um here we go. All right, so when you're doing green screen effects and uh, I'm using my laptop, uh, it does takes a toll on your graphics card and it takes a toll on uh, your, your CPU. So as you can see, I wanna make sure I'm good here. And as y'all guys can see that now I have all four of me here in the video. So there it is. Real easy, real simple to do. Uh, and I did all of this here on Camtasia. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I really do take pride in enjoying what I do. Uh, and it's no secret uh, that I'm sharing with you guys. Uh, it's it me trying to give you guys the way I do it here on this YouTube channel to have fun. And I know I do a lot of tech videos and I change backgrounds and stuff like that. And it's relatively easy. Uh, and so if you do a little investment, uh, and with some software and stuff like that, you could do the same thing. It's not that hard to do, uh, but it does take a little time to invest uh, with green screen effects. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about the green screen effect and all its glory. See you guys on the next video. Peace.